Hello and welcome to the last video of this year for the uh, game called Diary of the Ten Commander. So, uh, we're gonna roll for the battle type as always. And we're gonna start right away. I have a 6 here. And the 6 is advanced to contact. And this is how our engagement matrix is gonna be set up. So let's shuffle these, put two in the front, tax of these battle encounter tokens, one here, one here, if I remember, yeah, we also have one on the sides. All right, I'm going to start open up, and uh, our battle readiness, let's calculate as a three, five, Six, nine, eleven, and we have, I think, only five turns layout. Okay, let's start uncovering these. I'm testing my awareness, which is now four or less. Uh, failure, but I can reroll because the tank is open up, and I succeed. I'm gonna uncover these two. There's a puma. And a mine, anti tank mine. So, on one of these, I can react, the other one will react before me. And uh, I'm gonna react on the mine because if I don't, there's a chance it explodes. So, we're gonna try to avoid that. So, that's a group crew performance test. Let's try to avoid the mine. Six. I can't use, I can use a 5 here, and these two, yeah, I can use all of these. So that's going to be passed, we're going to avoid the mine, start that. But now Puma will attack us, and I'm open up, so I'm kind of in danger here, but let's see what's going to happen. Puma. That's a... Uh, Armored, armored car. So first of all, uh, it's not gonna roll roll to see will it attack me because it's actually in the position where it's gonna hit. And even if open up, I'm kind of it's gonna be only one attack. Or uh, let's roll two dice to see where the hit's gonna. Okay, six and a four. That's a miss. Now. I can, if I want to spend two, oh by the way, I should spend already one battle readiness point, I'm on ten, just to test my awareness. I'm gonna spend two to shoot at this Puma, and again, it's a group Cooper test. Let's try to destroy it. Unusable, but I can use all of these. That's not a perfect hit, but uh, for the armor card, that's uh, destroyed in D6 casualties. And it's gonna be one casualty, maybe just the driver. So destroyed armor are casualty. Alright, we clear that up. That's our first turn. Uh I'm gonna spend a ver uh, one point to do a awareness test again. I succeed, we're gonna Clear this stack here. I'm going big stacks because I want points. Okay, there's a sniper and a panzer. All right, so I will react to sniper. Otherwise, I will get hit on the cupola because we open up. So let's do. Give it a sniper. I think it's something different. Uh, no, it's still crew. Commands test. Okay. See. I can use five, I can use four, use this four, I can use one. It's still a pass, so the sniper is going to miss me. I'm okay. Now the panzer will fire at us. He has to pass this test here, skill test of four or less. Uh, he didn't actually. Alright, so it's not gonna fire, which 
give us opportunity to fire back at it if I want to. That will cost me two. Yeah, we'll do that. Two battle readiness, and let's try to destroy that panzer. I guess we caught caught him caught him off guard. All right, can use a six. I can use a five, but can use these two. So we were unsuccessful, and that was one shot we had. Panzer out. We lost the contact with it. All right. Uh, that was a turn. I'm gonna spend another battle readiness to uh, to uncover this. So we have a Ferdinand and the German platoon. I think I'm gonna react to Ferdinand. A fire first. Oh, by the way, I should have spending. Um, uh, the Puma, I don't remember. Did I? Oh, yeah, I did spend. Okay, so I have to spend one just to fire at the Ferdinand after I uncovered it. So, yeah, let's try to destroy it. Unusable, but all of this I can assign. Oh, yeah, I four can go here, and the rest is like uh, trees and twos. So it's gonna be hit, but that is just special hit. D for Ferdinand, that's abandoned. D6 minus two casualties, so not destroyed, just abandoned. Okay. Oh, six casualties. So uh, actually, minus two, that's four. So lots of crew members dead. Uh, so just abandoned. Ferdinand's. Casualties. All right. But now this German platoon it fire at me. They do have to roll for that. Oh, they are not not successful actually. I'm fine. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna spend a battle point to shoot at them. Why not? Let's destroy them too. Missed their chance. Okay, can't use this, but I can use a five here. Can't use a four. Yeah, this is we missed. We didn't manage to. They run away. But everything is clear in front of us at least. That's one more turn. And I'm not gonna Test awareness. I'm gonna skip that so one of these will activate by itself. I keep these last few points. I'm still gonna be open up. So one, two, three. This will activate. Oh, it's an artillery hit. Okay, let me see. That's not good actually. Artillery strike. So let's uh, try to avoid it. Okay. Five, and I can use three here, and a three here. Uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna wait avoid that artillery strike. We are good. Okay, one more turn left. I will spend one point to try and cover this one. Uh, six, but I can reroll. A four, that's a success. A mine. Okay, so let's try to avoid it. Oh, that's a perfect avoidance. Okay. And that's it. Easy mission. We destroyed one uh, gold armor card and one Ferdinand was so much damage it is abandoned. This will be two points, two points here, that's a four. And I will get one more point from casualty, so that's five points. 
which I can deduct from this. So let's put this to uh, 18. As the fatigue is not really, really low. All right, I'm going to keep this here. So I remember because I'm going to probably play another mission right after this one. Let me clean this up. Okay, that was battle. We had two more. Uh, we have downtown downtime events. Now for this two, we're gonna have a training. So let me go for the training here. We do a crew performance test. If successful, up to two crew members can use one point to increase their skill. I can also increase any skill except the luck. All right, skill or uh, that's a skill. Yeah, they are skill, but not battle readiness. I can increase my battle readiness. All right, let's do that performance test. Unusable, unusable, usable, unusable. So we actually failed. We didn't train so well. All right. Damn. Okay, let's do another mission then. So. Oh, that's a 10. Uh, I think. No, that's a search and destroy. The so six turns. And. Uh, so let me set up the matrix. Let me show you. It's like uh, three ones behind me. Corners and twos on planks. Okay, couple of this with stacks. By the way, I did have like two left, so that's uh, this should be on 20. Previous mission, I forgot to uh, take in, into account uh, the tokens I didn't remove. Right. Okay, uh, battle readiness 11. I guess I'm gonna immediately spend one to check this stack in front of us. Successful. Never mind. And a uh, tank trench. I'm gonna react to mine. Can't use, can't use, can't use. Yeah, mine will explode. Didn't manage to, unless I use the luck, my last luck. Not gonna use the last luck. So here's the problem, though. Uh, tank is open up, so I'm in danger. Tank, mine. It's gonna be one hit. We're gonna be immobilized for sure. And if it's open up, I'm also going to get the wound. And it is open up. So let's see the hit first. Six and a four. No, nothing there. We, we are still immobilized. And now I have to roll for myself on the wound chart. If it's something bad, I, can, I guess I can use my last luck. All right. That's uh, 13, which is clean wound. Went through right arm muscle bleeding. Okay, so I'm bleeding. I'm not gonna use the luck. Just put this here. Here's the problem though. I'm out of the I'm out from, from the rest of the fight, so all the enemy is gonna activate first. I cannot stop the bleeding. If I could, if I had like um, first aid, I could remove it. So I would be like dressed up and I could still be, be operating. 
but without it I'm out which means only my crew members right now are trying to do their best uh, which means one less die because I think I want to use my luck on this but no more luck okay so I'm not actually hit but from this time on no more luck so we somehow we still are mobilized now there is also 10 trench we need to deal with this happens simultaneously so we may actually fall in the trench as the mine exploded um so let's try all right that's uh that's a pass so nothing there okay that was the first turn uh, for the second, we spend awareness. I'm gonna test this flank here. Uh, successful. We have a tiger and a German platoon. I'm gonna react to target tiger. Uh, oh wait a minute, we mobilized. That changes a lot. Now let me check because. We don't do uh, if we don't manage to fix our tracks, uh, we will have to abandon tank. Just go to immobilize uh, four BR points. So we are here, so and that's a crew performance test. Okay, let's try fix our tracks. Unusable, usable, unusable. We can use these three. So we will fix our track. Oh, then I'm gonna do the rest. So back to the tiger and the German platoon. Okay, so as I said, we're gonna react to tiger first. Let's try to hit it. Uh, this number two means we have to reroll two of our successes. So it's not easy to destroy the tiger. So right now all is success. So I can reroll, let's say, these two. But it's still gonna be it's still gonna be success. All right. So we're gonna hit the tiger, and it's gonna be partial hit. So it's abandoned and these six minus three casualties which in this case one casualty and abandoned tiger tiger one casualty all right that's not bad but now this german platoon will try to fire at us it will succeed which means and i i will still open up so I'm gonna get hit and this time I cannot use luck. And that's uh, 13. Okay, the same one. Clean wound went, went right through our, our right arm muscle and I'm bleeding. So I cannot, I just can't avoid that this was, it's gonna happen anyway. All right, I'm out of it, which means one die less. Now, uh, we can, oh, by the way, we should spend one to fire a tiger. We can spend another one to try to destroy this German platoon. So let's try that. Uh, this is actually a six. So I can use a five and a one. Okay, so what happens when you have equal numbers? You fail. You have to have more. This is a failure. German platoon will escape. All right. This turn, uh, I cannot use awareness right now because I'm out. Uh, I we can put the button up at least. That's gonna give us plus one DRM. The rest of the crew. crew. And at least I'm not gonna get hit again. Because one more hit when you're bleeding and you you just die. 
uh, there is no way to survive after that. You can't sustain two wounds. So I have to button up. One of these will activate. I could technically use the skill of the one of the other guys to try to uncover enemies. You can do that, but I'm not going to do it. Let's just see what's going to activate. One, two, three, four, five. Behind us. It's an MG bunker. Okay, the bunkers actually can't do nothing against the button up. Uh, I'm not so sure. Did I even put the. Ah, here it is. So if it's open up, there is a wound. If it's not, we can spend two to fire at it, but we will not. And it actually stays because it's unmovable, it's gonna stay here. But right now it's gonna be uh, double the points of the unrevealed, so it's two points, negative two points. So that's for the bunker, that's just for the bunker how it works. Okay, so that's a problem. Uh, let's go here. And also, uh, it will uh, activate each turn with the rest, so we might actually choose to destroy it. Maybe I should, yeah. Let's let's just try to just destroy it. Because it's gonna be pesky bunker. Alright, so this is a seven, this is a six, this is a four, and this is a four. Uh I can use one four, but we are unsuccessful, so bunker's gonna stay there. Alright, let's go to here. See what else gonna activate now we're in trouble because I'm really hit my crew members are not good without me okay tank trench in which we can fall in we are have plus one DRM so seven a five which I can use a five which I cannot use and a three which I can use so it's not a success, we need more. So we're gonna fall in into this anti tank trench. Tank is immobilized, uh, we are not open up, so just immobilized. And now, if we don't succeed to fix it, we will have to abandon tank. Which is not good for me. Okay, a six. Six? Yeah, this is a failure. We have to do to abandon tank. So lots of things gonna happen. Let me just check here. Uh we were doing the battle was I think search and destroy. Yeah, no special conditions. But I think for the bleeding there is one condition which is not good for me. Just go to bleeding. Uh, and the end of the battle, I have to roll a d6 on a roll of one to three. Bleeding crew member is dead. Now there should be here that. Okay, there's no special conditions. Okay, so there's a chance for me to die here. Let's hope this will not happen. So one to three, I will bleed out before we get back to our. Uh, positions all right i survived and after two months we go i <laughs> we're gonna go back into the action let me clean this up uh, but lots of negative points first of all 10 points because our tank was abandoned that will put us at 30 here so let's just i need to add 10 and there are these that are left one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The so seventeen battle fatigue points, and we only do did two damage. I mean, two points here, so it's fifteen plus twenty is going to be thirty-five. Okay, so that's not good. 
and I'm gonna do one more let me lower this to one one more battle or a clo close to Rene and uh, we need to do one more uh, down, uh, how down downtime event and I'm gonna stop the video there okay there's a rumor and there are crew improvement tokens I think I'm gonna do a rumor. So let me roll 3d6. That's 12. Let's see what kind of rumor we have. Uh, you hear a rumor that one random crew member can't be you has one large sum of money on a poker game if you have a friend started with that crew member gain three crew improvement tokens of your choice if not write down the name of that crew member if he dies gain two random crew improvement okay so it is random right now i'm friend with ashton so if it's ashton we might get some improvement tokens so let's see it's a five okay so it's actually liam so Liam, I have to write that down. He's the skunk. <laughs> He's the stinky one. So let's write just that Liam. So two through tokens. Guys. Just gonna write rich that he's now rich. He won large sum of money. If he dies, we actually gonna get stuff from from his, I guess, uh, locker room. Uh, too bad. If I was friend with him, we would immediately get three. All right. Maybe his like uh, rich aunt died. He got some like <laughs> money, <laughs> the states. Anyway, that will be that. Uh, no more luck, and lots of. A uh, lot of uh, path ahead of us to get to Paris. One more battle uh, or in Rene. I can do that later. But so far, that's it. And Happy New Year. And see you next time in the New Year with a new video. Thank you and goodbye.